All right. We are on the 28th of March, 2023, 9.40 a.m., Freeborn County, Southern Minnesota. And I'm doing this one as kind of uh, an experiment because I've watched someone else's um, uh, videos and they asked for some some input. I had that they were using it's uh, Pam and Jim over at uh, as a Red Rose Homestead homesteading something like that. They were using the fun panel homemade fun panel uh, cookers trying to do bread. So that's what I got rolling today. Now, I'm gonna set this down. Hopefully it won't get you too seasick there. I just went to the store after work last night and grabbed some frozen white bread dough. It's thought it raised a little bit. I got no clue as to what I'm supposed to do. But uh, I'm using the fun panel that's as drawn in the plans. And I believe that's what uh, they made on there. This, this one is old political signs and the aluminum HVAC tape. This, this small cooker was built uh, in October of 2016. It's been knocking around my garage. It's all dusty, dirty, still going strong. This is the Tiantan Sun Funnel. It is oversized, also made out of political signage. This was made in September of 2016. So uh, we're just gonna roll and see how bread turns out here and see if we can help them out in their quest there. So learn something along the way. Away we go. All right, we are 30 minutes in. The timer went off in the house and uh, so it's time to bump these ahead. They have really, uh, well that one has risen up. This one's risen up a little bit too. Um, this is the smaller fun panel. This is the slightly oversized sun funnel. I have an admitted preference for the sun funnel over the fun panel, but that's just, that's just me, it's easier to make them, so. I make them out of uh, political signage. Let's see if I can do this without tipping things over. I'm going to open ahead 30 minutes. Move the site to the other one. Get ahead 30 minutes ish. All right. Well, I'm not so sure. I might, I might have to. It's probably already touching the inside the lid. I don't know. I'll just let it roll. I'm learning as I go here back out in 30 minutes see what's up all right we are an hour in the sun funnel the oversized one uh, 
is looking much better than the other. And actually, I did uh, smear a little butter on the top of the dough. Um, so I'm not sure if that's what's helping with the browning. The fun panel, the regular sized one, it's uh, it has hit the lid. Let's see if I can get out of there. Eh, that's not helping. But it's it's looking pretty gooey yet, so. to bump it ahead another 30 minutes we are an hour in boy it's really smelling bready over here on the, uh, forgot to mention and I forgot to do last time um, I need to I need to find a different setup here I did rotate them both and I will do that over here too boy that smells good not supposed to have the gluten but <laughs> or the gluten does nasty things to my joints um i'm almost tempted to to get my little thermometer out i may do that in a little bit here um so far the, the oversized uh sun funnel is has pulled out into the lead here so I'll keep you posted we're one hour in all right we're an hour and 20 minutes in here it's smelling so pretty it's got a nice uh, nice looking crust on there I'm gonna stick the thermometer and see what we're doing here Woo. <laughs> Yeah, oh boy, that smells like yowza. Wow. All right. Let's see if I can hold that steady. 180. 190. See that? Am I shaking? It's just just a fuzz over 200. I'm calling that good. So that was the so that is the oversized Tiang Tiang uh, Sun Funnel. This is the Fun Panel. It's Starting to get a little color on the edge there. Um, you know, I'm gonna let this roll. As my late father used to say, sometimes you gotta dance with the girl you came with. So let's leave this and see how it does. Well, it's been three hours now. This is smelling bread like. I got a golden kind of crust on there. I'm gonna turn this away from the sun. Maybe we can get a little less glare. All right. Hopefully you can see all that. I got my little thermometer here. Oops. Well, that's 
it's taking right off, isn't it? 80, 190, 95, 200, 200. So we got there. We got there. It just took three hours instead of an hour and a half with the other one. So I'm calling this uh, a success as well. This is, I believe it's the, uh, <laughs> it's, I think it's the 28th of March. And we're three hours in. I'm, uh, I'm happy with this. I knew there'd be a difference. I just didn't think it would be this great, great of a difference. So we reached 200 internal temperature. Um, bread's a success. I will try and contact Rose Red Homestead or what? I think that's the name of their, their channel. They were trying to find a panel cooker that would bake yeast bread. So hopefully this will help them as well. I don't think I'll be using the sun funnel as much, uh, especially not this regular sized one. Uh, maybe in the summertime, but, uh, or fun panel, I'm sorry. I'll stick with the sun funnel. So thanks for tagging along and, uh, I'll try and add a shot of the two loaves side by side in the house on the cooling rack. So, away we go.